right, before we get this interview started, I do want to remind everyone to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and check us out on all podcasting platforms. Susanna Malik, you what are you four three? Four two and a half. Remember that half something. <laughs> four two four <laughs> four two with the biggest fucking attitude. I swear to God, yesterday I was setting up my podcasting, right? I was setting my podcasting thing up, and I asked some. I wasn't even talking to you. you wasn't. I asked somebody else. I said, "Hey, how does my tent look?" And what did you say? Look like shit. She said it looked like shit. She said it looks like shit. <laughs> you might know Susanna from Star Wars episodes, more recently The Mandalorian, but also some other things you've been on. Yes, I've been on Boba Fett. Okay. I've been on uh, Obi Wan. Okay. I've been on Little Women. Of- Little Women of L.A. Well, hold on. So it's for like little, like it's yeah. It was all like little women, like yeah. little women. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> damn, short people can get goddamn shows too. <laughs> but also, also, you were on a what is it, a Christmas movie? Not a Christmas movie. I was on um, Californication. Okay. I've been on Mad TV Christmas. Night. <laughs> I wrote Christmas movie now. <laughs> I make my own Christmas movie just sitting on Santa's lap. Shit. <laughs> trying to get all the damn treats from him. All he does is leave my house when he walks, you know, on his sleigh. Talk about this little crazy bitch need to go. <laughs> you have one of the best personalities that I've met so far at this convention. Uh, someone uh, someone else told me that you had such a fun personality. How long have you been acting for? It's been a while. Yeah? It's been a while. But this is just my hobby. I mean, and I love the fans. I like being out with the fans and, and just seeing, the you know, the vibe. Mm-hmm. You know, some of them get a little... You know what I'm yeah. like? I'm not nobody. I'm just, you know, a regular human being like the rest of y'all. But it, it's 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 heartwarming. It's yeah. heartwarming. I do really enjoy it's it. It's fun, huh? Yeah, correct. And correct. you live in Los, An- Los Angeles I area. Do. And you're with the talent agency? Yeah, well, Central Casting has actually got me with the stuff that I've been in now. Okay. They're the ones who have got a lot of going on for me. And thank God they've they've called me and keep calling me so i guess i'm doing doing something something right doing something right right. do you have a favorite scene uh not even even star wars related just in general that you've done just a scene that you really just enjoyed and made part like you really put everything into it because when you do the star wars stuff you're dressed up right in a costume yeah correct so it's something different i like the reality tv show like the little women of la because you get to be yourself what network's that on that is on lifetime okay i'm gonna have to watch i did season eight if you're going to do it, go to the end. Okay. It was the end. Um, we went to Cancun. Okay. Actually, this was my favorite scene just because I was being myself. Uh-huh. I'm the type of person, it's either you're right or you're wrong. Mm-hmm. You know? And I don't like people. Bullying. She don't cut no, sh- cut no, no slack. Shit. <laughs> you don't give a shit. Know. I don't give a shit. <laughs> you old, young, whatever. It's, it's, it's right is right. That's what's right. right is wrong. So one of the young ladies... That was on the show. She's the main character. I'm just a little nobody, but she has a daughter. We were in Cancun filming, and you only have to be 18 in Mexico to drink. Right, right. I remember. So they kept pushing her daughter, like sending drinks over to her, and her mom is an ex alcoholic. Okay. So oh. You, you know that that's dear to her. You know you don't want to follow parents' footsteps sometimes. Right, right, right. And it's wrong. See, my parents didn't drink. That's why I'm a drunk. You see, that's, <laughs> that's why I'm a drunk. <laughs> I think my dad, he drank too much. That's why I fucking came out this short. <laughs> but it's just like, they kept giving her drinks. And then one of the guys was like, are you going out with us tonight? Or are you going to go stay with your mama? And I'm looking at him like, what is it? That, you know what I'm saying? And he was like, well, I'm not talking to you. I said, this is an A and B conversation. Right. I'm seeing your ass out. Got up security. Got, I, I mean, I was going to whoop the dude's <laughs> rear end. It just got real stupid. Yeah. You know? But then when you see. I don't really watch none of these shows, but when you do see these things, look at this mofo. Jack we Daniel. Jack Daniel's in the house. <laughs> oh, yeah, and, he doesn't, and he doesn't even drink. <laughs> and he doesn't even drink. His name is Jack Daniel. We're live. I don't, okay. Well, I just, no, just what we're recording, it's not live right now. It's not live. He just recording. walks into the it interview. Is. It's recording? Or it's, it's, recor- it's recording. Okay. It's recording live, but not yeah, live. You ruined, you ruined it. <laughs> I was supposed to be a part of this bullshit. Hey, you need to sit here like jiggle your titties for us just because you have to. <laughs> <laughs> I said, not your ball sack. <laughs> yeah, I know, what? what the fuck? I'm not I told you she don't give a shit. <laughs> I can still see my dick. I ain't Santa Claus. Well, I want to see it. Hello? Hello? <laughs> So, you know, sorry, you can't, you know, like this. I'm, uh, done. I'm not hung like a hand. No, Jack Daniel, <laughs> Susanna Malik. I always want to say your last name totally wrong. Thank you for coming on, being a part I of my show. I do you. want to do a full 30 minutes with you. 
Okay. Uh, sometime, maybe next month. I think you have a great personality. Okay. Fantastic. I appreciate you. I appreciate you make me you. like the Star Wars. Everything you do, I want to watch it more now. I appreciate Such you. Such a lovely person. Thank you for being a fan, and thank you for loving me. Absolutely. Thank you so I much. I appreciate it, boss. All right. Thank you. That's the time we got with her. Peace thank out, you. rock thank on, you. and much love. <laughs> Bye. Bye. This is the Loud Spot outro by Nothing Short of Tragic. Is this all talk with no action? No. Is this my thoughts with distraction? No. Is this what I bought that's in fashion? Or is this the loud spot with Sebastian? Yes. Does nothing short of tragic have us back again? Yes. Does everything that's good really have to end? Yes. A pin post has a pin show, so to get more episodes, make an order, this is over.